on June 26, 2020, at 12 a.m. GMT, a Cold Space Rescue Challenge map was issued to ICO participants from around the world. All participants were given 24 hours to develop AI strategies to solve the same challenge. In Cold Space Rescue Challenge, teams are required to build a real robot, develop and program appropriate algorithms and strategies for both real and virtual autonomous robots to navigate through both real and virtual worlds. Additionally, they have to search and collect objects while competing with another team's robot that is also searching and collecting objects in the same real and virtual worlds. During the challenge, the robot needs to overcome barriers, avoid traps, and swamps. If the robot successfully makes a deposit, the points of the objects deposited will be doubled. The virtual field has been divided into a 3 by 3 matrix. When the robot moves into each section, the robot's corresponding location information will be assigned to the robot. Location information can be used for the development of AI algorithms and strategies, such as path planning and search algorithms. The winner of the challenge will be the robot with the highest points. Hello everyone, I am Priyo Anggoto Arifin. I am 11 years old. I am from Indonesia. I am in primary school. I study at Sabil Fala Islamic Primary School in Sukoto, Nasab District, Sarjara Agency, Java Province, Indonesia. I am a sixth gender. This is my first international robot contest experience. I am so excited and proud. I am in first the rescue first step the 12 in Cospes robot platform. I've been involved in robotics for a year. I won the third place of autonomous drone racing challenge in wonderful Indonesia robot challenge contest last December. At the time I use autonomous drone program software. I use block diagram of robotic system. The challenge was the participant code their scramble drone to perform obstacle racing challenge. The fastest robot, the fastest drone that the finish line was the winner. The chance for this competition is the robot can navigate on the floor. It will use ultrasonic sensor modules and preload intelligence. The robot will scan the floor and detect the colors. When it found object in black, cyan and red color, it will detect them. Then it will deposit the object to the orange object. My strategy is I am going to program my robot but deposit all the project in any color in only one way so it will need no much time to complete the mission i believe i will complete the challenge and win the contest wish me luck I study at SKPP 82. I have participated in Coast Space Rescue Challenge First Step Under 12. I have been involved in robotics since 9 years old. Since then, my father teached me a basic robot rob programming and code the Python for small robots. I'm here to share about my strategy. First, when robot found the trap area, the robot will avoid it. <coughs> the second one, when robot go to deposit area, the robot will take the object before the robot deposit. <coughs> But the robot 
can take all the colors. When there is an obstacle, the robot in 12 cm, the robot will turn right. But if there are no obstacles, the, the robot will continue forward. The, then, what I learned about Ghost Space is then what I learn the cause space is need to meet patient and calm even at less point. Anyway, the the cause space robot is fun. And off we go! In this demo game, we will minimize any manual intervention. Blue robot is depositing. Red robot is depositing. Blue robot is depositing. Blue robot has overtaken red robot. Oh no! Blue Robot has fallen into the trap! 
points of the undeposited objects are reset and lost. Red robot needs to make a deposit before it can continue collecting. One minute left. Red robot is depositing. Looks like a close match. Blue robot is depositing. What a move! Blue Robot wins this challenge. Congratulations!